Hey, what is going on everybody? Welcome to my very first playthrough of Kirby and the Forgotten Land demo. I was so excited when I saw this game. The demo for this game got launched earlier today. I was just, oh my god, yes. Kirby, I finally get to play you again in a perfectly 3D environment. <laughs> I am so happy right now. Like. Oh my gosh, I am a diehard Kirby fan. I love most a lot of the mainline Kirby series and some of the spin-offs, but mainly the mainly the mainline series. So forgive me if I geek out here. I'm just oh, I'm just in love with this right now. I have played the demo before. It is amazing. I highly recommend anyone who has a Nintendo Switch to play this. They will not be disappointed. They w So in this demo, there are of course, of three stages to start with. There is a tutorial stage, there is a one complete level that you can play through, and then there is a boss level that you will play. So, let's get started and go to playing with, with Solo here, and now there are two difficulty settings for this. There is Spring Breeze mode, and there's Wild mode. So, Wild mode, you'll start off with little, with little life, but you get to collect a lot more star coins. And in Spring Breeze mode, you it like gives you a lot of health, so if anyone's prone to not picking up things as easily as most people do, then this will be the easy mode for you in that case. So I play, I played already the adventure in Wild mode, so I'm just going to continue playing it like that. And here we have a cinematic cutscene opening. Kirby in his element in Planet Popstar, Dreamland. Everything just looks so beautiful. Here's Warp Star. Uh, everything's just looking up Kirby. Until. Uh oh. Yep. Transdimensional doorway. It wouldn't be a Kirby game without a transdimensional doorway. And it's sucking everything in. That's Kirby's thing. Kirby! To the rescue! No, the Waddleys are being taken. Bandana D! No! Kirby, save him. Oh, never mind. Kirby, no! Somebody save Kirby! Kirby gets a whole bunch of mixed up here. I guess transdimensional travel will do that to you. Now where on earth did we wash up? It's kind of giving me Blue Lagoon vibes, if any of you have know, know that movie is, but... It's a very old movie, but it has its charm. All right, here we are, in a perfectly 3D environment. Ooh. Oh, and we get to do this again. Oh, this looks beautiful. Like, I don't know, like, there in past Kirby games, like, this first started in Return to Dreamland, where you can just hover, like, in a floaty. And you just, basically, it was a 2D movement. But now in 3D, this looks all kinds of good now. So let's see here. Oh, we can suck up the shell. Rocks. Oh, so we can turn debris now into star bullets. That's good. I like it. Alright, so here we are in the tutorial level. Let's get things started. So we jump. Collect star coins. I just love this game so far. It's amazing. I love it. Can't wait for the full release. I hi again, I highly recommend any of you guys to pick it up. And just to, and just for you guys to know, I will be doing a full let's play of this game. You can count on that. And for those of you who are enjoying the video so far, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel so you guys can see a whole lot more content coming your way in the future. All right. 
So basically we have the have all the moves down. So here we are. Oh, that opening never gets old. It's beautiful. Flower petals. This natural dystopia look is just beautiful here. All right, I forgot to turn that off. Um, so yeah, so there. Here's the control settings: are you can change it like to put Y as attack or A to drop items. Like it depends on what you're more comfortable with. That's mixing everything up. So B gets we jump. A is to drop abilities and such and such. So I really, ah, I'll just leave it at type A. So I'll turn auto swallow off. Because, well, Auto Swallow is on. I, didn't, I think that's gonna be a set, a thing now where when you inhale an enemy that has an, a copy ability, it just automatically, you'd automatically swallow them and transform. But I keep it off because I like to keep that traditional sense of Kirby on. So, yeah, so that's how it's gonna be now. Okay. So, let's get started. Oh, Baranta Birds. Ah, nuts. I got hurt. I just love that music, it's amazing! Oh, March 25th, please come sooner. I keep getting hurt with that move. Oh, there's some energy! Ah. Uh, there we go. Huh? Oh, I got hurt. Bomb Kirby. And aim. Okay, got him. So yeah, this game is just amazing right here. Like, you, like you'll notice like most of the abilities I got toned may have may appear like toned down or some, but that's how it. But this does not shy away from the action at all. I'll tell you. Okay. Oh. Strike three, you're out. And in we go. Ooh, this is the cutscene where Carby is born. Ooh, the fox enemies. Suck him up, Kirby. Oh, here we go. Ta-da! Some people say it's gross, some people say it's creepy. I find it just silly and weird. So, here we go. I think this is gonna be replacing Wheel Kirby for the, for the game because, as you guys know, most Kirby games have Wheel Kirby in it, but I guess this will be... Oh, some scene right there. That was awesome. So yeah, so... I do believe that Wheel Kirby will not be in this game, sadly, but this is a, a fun little substitute. I kinda like it. I wonder if this will be the core mechanic- This- I uh, know- what am I saying? It will be the core mechanic of the game. I mean, like, will this be used? Like, you know how most Kirby gimmicks are used at the end of the game? So, I just- I'm trying to understand this a little better. All right, so now we're in the city limits. <gasps> They're the Waddledees. We'll save you, my friends. I will. I promise. We'll save you, Waddledees. Wouldn't it be awesome if we rescued Bandanity and he just followed us like a helper all all the time? I mean, that would be awesome, wouldn't it? Okay, final destination. All off. Most of these cutscenes, like most of these levels here are based off the cutscenes we saw in the trailers from previous trailers. I mean, like, you know, from September, then from the January, well, not January, but the last Nintendo Direct, I think that was on last month. Oh, Waddle Town. It's in shambles. Oh, God. 
This is hurts my heart to see them all get locked up so like you gotta pity these guys. Oh no! Oh it's you! It's Elflin! Oh no, have him cornered! And no no. But why'd I have to use such a big cage on him though? But he makes such cute, adorable noises. I don't know, I just... Everyone's just so sus of him. Do we save him? I mean, it's not like we can do anything else here. So I guess we have to go into a bottle, a boss, boss battle here. Alright, die, you guys! Die! And they got blown up. And there we go. You're free! There we go. Phew, you saved me! Thank you! But what about the other guys? The Waddle Dees? They were all captured and taken away. We fought those beasts as hard as we could, but they kept coming back for more. Now I'm the only one left. I have to go save them. I have to! Don't worry, we'll help you. Until you inevitably betray us. What? You'll help me? You'll help me save everyone? That's great! So, your name is Kirby. I'm Elphalin. Nice to meet you. And now we have our traveling companion, Elphalin. Though a lot of people online have saying, Oh, this guy is sus. Another Margalor, um, helping a friend, like, I don't know, we've seen a lot of Kirby allies who just end up turning against us, like, Magalor and Mars from, Mars from Kirby and Superstars Ultimate, and there, and there was Magalor from Return to Dreamland, so yeah, there have been a lot of people who have crossed Kirby, like, Kirby is just naively kind, like, his naivete is just... You know, that's what you gotta admire about him. He, he has a good heart, but some people t take advantage of that, and that's just, I find that scummy. But, now that we've saved Elflin, let's continue on with the rest of this demo. Okay, here we are. Downtown Grassland. Let's start. On wild mode. Here we are. As you guys may know, these guys are called, these fox-like characters are called a woofies. And let's see here. Um, just reading it here. It says, a woofy. A common beast that can be found all over the new world. They're pretty cute, but they have a dangerous side. They'll growl and jump at anyone who crosses them. A lot, a whole bunch of these critters have attacked the Waddle Dee. Funny, you'd think they get along. Yep, that's one of the new entries we have going off in these game, like... From the figures, going around to everywhere else. You'll find these guys. They're cute, but I have to destroy them. So, yeah, so these guys will be taking over for the Waddle Dees in this new beast-like adventure. I don't know, it's just, I find it a little awkward now that they're going to be replacing the Waddle Dees as bad guys, but... It kind of fits the theme, doesn't it? Here we go. Ooh, let's see. Make tulips bloom. Okay, so yeah, so we have missions here. That'll make you play this level tons of time. Cut. Cut. So who are these rabbit enemies? I have no idea. They're, they're totally new to me. Right? So you're dead. Come here, strawberry shortcake. Kirby's favorite strawberry shortcake. Alright, so another tulip we've got made bloom. Now what's next? Ooh, let's see. Introducing Bending Mouth! 
Ooh, what's next? Die with my soda cans of fury! And the cool thing about vendor mode is that you get recovery items from it. Oh, nuts. I can use some recovery right now. Let's see. There we go. And you have limited soda cans, so use them sparingly. I wonder what happens if we use them all up. Let's see. Using them all up, using them all up, using them all up. Using them all up. Sold out. <laughs> so we're out of soda cans. Oh wait, so if you collect the soda cans, you get to recollect ammunition. I get it now. Alright, that's a neat little trick to know. Okay. You see, we learn a lot of things when we, when we test ideas. Okay, so we got a gotcha. Nice. Like, I don't... I hardly... Ah, look out. And down you go, bully. Take that! Alright. So, yeah. So, it's just... This game is just beautiful. The 3D environment. Everything is just amazing. I am, again, I am definitely getting this game on release. I've already pre-ordered it. So here we go. Taking a stroll on our warp star in the new mysterious lands of known enemies that are trying to kill us. But, don't let, don't let this game fool ya. It may look cute, but it's dangerous. Bomb Kirby. Uh, they really like making us use Bomb Kirby a lot here, don't they? Okay, that's one bad guy down. Shucks, those I hate you. <sighs> I just love everything about this game. It's just... I know I'm, I, I know I'm just obsessing about this now, but I, come on! It's a 3D Kirby game. You... I know most of you have heard that we were supposed to get a Kirby game that was in like for the GameCube, but they canceled it like in recent news. That, like that was displayed in in like what was it? Oh yeah, from Game Explain. Yeah, I to be honest, I had no, known about that project a while ago, a long time ago. Like I was looking for the internet one day and I see a 3D Kirby game. I said, Nah, it can't be. And then. No, it is it is a 3D Kirby game, but the thing is they scrap it. I don't know why they canceled such a perfectly good idea. I mean, why would they do that? It looked like it was in good progression, like good content. I just don't know. Depending on what Nintendo decides, that's how they choose to do things. Oh, look, another tulip. There we go. Like, why would you cancel it's just a good thing and you didn't even give it a try? I mean that that's what gets gets me gets my goat. Like, why why would you, why would you do that? Why why? It, you, we could enjoy so much of um, much fun adventures if we could do that together. Got another figurine. It's just so weird to see Kirby do poses when he's in mouthful mode. All right. <gasps> Waddle Dee, we'll come and save you. Don't worry. I will be right there. Papa's coming. Uh oh. Yeah, I should have watched out for that. The same thing. Oh, a mini boss. Cool. Wild Edge. This is this is just like in Kirby Clash. In Super Kirby Clash. Like you see, like how is this guy even in the game? Like, well, it, not this particular version of of Giant Edge, but you notice that he has a lot. Uh, got him. And down you go. Got it. Yay, Waddle saved. See ya. Onward. We must save more Waddle Dees. Oh wow. Hi. How you doing? Uh-oh. 
I'm mean, gonna make pork chop. Oh, well, not pork chop, but uh, like I don't know. I'll make barbecue ribs out of ya. Okay, that move is just not calculated properly. I guess this is why they released the demo, like to collect data on how, what they can improve on before the actual release. Oh, what? Dumb mouth? That's gross. We're here to save you, old friend. Don't worry. Goodbye, Waddle Dee number 973. Yes, I know Waddle Dee's by their number. We're on a first number name basis. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Let's see. Hmm. And down you go. Backhand. Uh, up here? Ah, there we go. I mean, I only played a demo once, so don't don't sue me, everybody. I'm just still trying to learn what I need to do. Got it. Ooh. And down you go. Yay! All Waddle Dee's found. Cone Kirby makes a clean getaway. Why would he just stop? It's crazy, I don't know what he did that for. Down he goes. The buffalo. Down you go. Yeah, we found all the tulips! Whoa! Ah! Great! There's a bigger one here. Down we go. You'll never catch me, turtle! Down here! Quickly! Oh god. We're trapped. No, we're not. Bye. Oh, we're gonna le leave a lot more work for the construction workers and plumbers later. Goodbye. Yay. Saved all the Waddle Dees. 100%! Nice! Kirby! Sir Kibble! Bomb Kirby! Alright! So we're nearing the end of this demo here. Wild mode. I hope the game is gonna be this easy, like, in most Kirby games do. Ah, oh, there's a Woofies. Down you go. Oh, you guys saw that, right? I know I saw that. We saw it in the trailer. Cool. Kirby had a feast. Banana. Oh god. You can feel the vibrations. I'll go with my trusty handy dandy sword here. Let's get this boss. Yoo-hoo! Anybody home? Uh-oh. Uh oh Kirby! Uh, let me go! Hands off! Strong Arm Beast Gamagori! 
Give back our friends, you jerks. <laughs> uh oh. There he is. Oh, it really is. I gotta admit, this is almost like Mario Odyssey. Oh, come back here, you. I just need to focus here. Nice try, big boy. Ah, nuts, he got me. Hi, how you doing? Uh oh, run for it! Ah, he still got me. Ah. All right, I'm getting too impatient here. And down he goes. Ha. And we've cleared the game, everybody. This is a very fun demo. It was a little short, I won't lie, but still, the action in this game does make up for it. Like. The graphics, the mechanics, the adventure, it just makes up for a lot of things here. I can really tell this is going to be a very fun game. Wow. I just can't wait to play it. I already pre-ordered it. I can't wait for it. There's Needle. Drill. That we all want to play with. Why couldn't they put one of the new abilities in? I just don't understand. Now, why couldn't they? And roller coaster mode. I saw it in a trailer. Oh god. I forgot what that mode is called. I don't even know what that is called. <sighs> If only this game could be played a multiplayer online, that would be fun. But I guess not. And those sub games are just looking so gorgeous, I can't wait to play those. Fishing with Kirby, making burgers, uh, and getting like those little gotcha figures. Just like cool with cool little fun facts. And upgrading those abilities are gonna be awesome too. There's the Woofies, there's Waddledees. We're just gonna love all of this. Oh, there's Tropic Woods. Hey, Tropics. How's it going? So these are the bosses we're gonna have to fight. Woo! And Meta Knight, I saw him. But what is King Dedede doing in this game? I don't know. I mean, I mean, what is he doing in this world, and why does he look so different? <laughs> oh God! This game is a work of art. I, I am just an awestruck at how fun this is gonna be. And yes, you can play this game with the evolved versions of the copy abilities that are available in it so far. So you have Ice, Bomb, Cutter, and Sword. It's very limited with the abilities for this demo. I mean, again, it is a demo, but I would have liked something more to just sink my teeth into. But that is it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching my video of Kirby and the Forgotten Land demo. If you guys, again, if you guys did enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like. And subscribe to my channel for more future content because I will be doing a live, a live let's play, no not live, sorry. <laughs> I will be doing a let's play of this game. I hope you guys tune in to watch my videos. 
And I hope you guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys on the next video.